A growing number of home buyers are finding a workaround to the higher mortgage mortgage rates at this time. They're paying cash and it's not just the affluent home buyers who are opting for the all cash purchase. Our real estate expert joins us this morning. Lane Lyon is a realtor and of course managing broker at Coldwell Banker. Thank you so much for Good joining morning. us this Good morning. Good morning. Cash is king. Oh right? my goodness. For those that can get it right. Absolutely. Ugh. So not totally surprising given these crazy interest mm -hmm. rates that people are trying to find other ways to buy a house. Right. What do you make of this lane? Well, and it's it's not just the wealthy investors mm -hmm. either that are flashing all of this cash out there. In fact, a new survey from Redfin found that one third of home price uh, home sales across the country were all cash deals. So that's pretty amazing mm -hmm. when you think about it. Denver, it's about the same. That's up about 30 percent from last year and the highest it's been in about nine years. So why is all of this happening? Well, a big reason is the higher cost of borrowing money. So agents here in the metro area say we started seeing a lot of cash coming to the marketplace earlier this year in the luxury space mm -hmm. when we had more wealthy buyers who were able to insulate themselves from the mortgage rates, for example. Sure. But now we're starting to see some creative um, do goings on out there. Yeah. We're seeing people who are saying, look, I'm going to take advantage of all of my equity. I'm going to cash yeah. out. I'm going to sell my house. There you use go. that cash maybe to buy something smaller or less expensive. Okay. And even in some cases, family members who are fronting the money right. for loved ones who might be priced out otherwise yeah. and working out their own arrangements to pay them back with interest that's per assumably less than um, the 7% or high 6% range that we're seeing right People now. People are thinking outside the box right they now, are. Lane. Like you said, they're calling Aunt Martha, yeah. right? They've <laughs> got to call Aunt Martha and find out what I can do. And it's not the first time that we've seen cash really yeah. play a role in our housing market. If you think back to a couple of years ago, we had very low interest rates, yeah. a lot of buyer demand. There was a lot of those bidding wars mm, going on. Oh, yeah. And the people paying cash moved to the front of the line. Sure, because why not seeing, have it, boom, right there. Easier to work yeah. with. Yeah. So now we're seeing the cash back, and it's because the interest rates are higher. Okay, so these contracts are different when you're paying in all cash than if you're getting a loan. So so what can we expect sure. if we're paying cash? Beware when you're paying cash, there are typically fewer ways to get out of that contract oh. if you have cold feet. I'm one of those okay. who starts to change my mind. <laughs> yeah. So typically when you have a loan, you have more outs in the contract. So for example, if the house doesn't appraise and the mm. seller doesn't want to lower the price, you can get out of the deal. Okay. If all of a sudden I don't qualify for my loan at the end of the process, I can get out. Okay. Pretty much when you're paying cash after you have that home inspection, you're locked in, which is why sellers like cash offers. It's a big commitment. They're getting that yes. money, baby. Yep, yep. yep. All right. If, if you can't swing half a million in cash like me, what options do we have, Lane? There is hope for the rest of us. Don't <laughs> worry. You know, we are still in a market that is moving right along. In fact, we're seeing a lot of conditions that were very similar to 2019 mm -hmm. when we weren't worried about the housing market as much, even with the higher rates out there. So before I go, yeah. I have three things to keep in mind. If you Let's are going to be financing out there, first get pre-approved. You have to know how much you can afford okay. before you start getting out there. Be aware that there are first time home buyer programs, yeah. low down payment programs that. out there, rate buy downs, adjustable rate mortgages. You have to ask those questions. Okay. So call your realtor and maybe that rich cousin that there you have spoken to yeah. for a while um, and get out there because we do anticipate when the rates start to come down, the yeah. prices will go back up. Oh, such good information as always, Lane. Thank you so hey, much for joining for us this morning. Have a great day. Of course, you too. We'll